So here we are, SIA 2020, sitting here with Ben Anderson at Winter Park, the founder of Icelandic Ski Company. Yeah. And uh, we're gonna go demo his boards. Tell us a little bit about what we're gonna be trying here. Yeah, so I'm on the brand new, it's the uh, it's called the Saba Pro. Um, really excited for this ski, it'll be new for next year. And the goal behind it was, it was an athlete collaboration ski. You know, I got to work with all of our athletes from around the world, collecting feedback, and then put together kind of a smaller focus group of them to help process it. But we really gave them full creative control to create the shape that they wanted, the flex, the construction, the artwork, um, and everything. So we really gave them full creative control and um, couldn't be more excited with the final product. And Trevor's over here on the Nomad. 105 which is has been around for a little bit yeah yeah that's our top seller overall you know the nomad it's really been the um the same shape of ski that i was making in the garage almost 20 years ago so you know the, the dimensions stay consistent you know we evolved the rocker profile construction some stuff like that but overall it's just kind of the the grandfathered ski you know it's like every time we ask our reps athletes shops anything like oh is it time to update the nomad nope like keep it the same it's perfect don't break or uh don't fix something that's not broken so yeah and then i'm over here on something new the pioneer 109 yeah pioneer 109 this is kind of like our big mountain all mountain charger um good good amount of camber underfoot a little bit uh, stiffer flex profile this is really my personal daily driver i ski the ski every day can arc a turn um still versatile um just a fun powerful ripping ski all right well backing up to uh, making garage skis back in the day yeah. uh, tell me a little bit about that yeah you know i mean start icelandic was really just an idea i had in high school i was like oh i'm gonna start a ski company so started learning the process um met these brothers up in boulder colorado that were making skis in their backyard literally just like in a tough shed and they're the ones who kind of taught me that whole process. And then um, I went to school for a couple years out in Washington State, up in up in Bellingham uh, at Western, and I was uh, studying industrial design. But after a couple years, it was like I knew what I wanted to do, and just felt like I could learn other ways. So came back to Colorado, and those guys in um, Boulder stopped making skis. They had all the equipment, so they pretty much gave it to me. I mean, I paid them like twelve hundred bucks or something to get all the equipment and just set up shop in my parents' garage and press skis for about three years. And it was. <laughs> A lot of trial and error. I mean, I'd literally build a pair and then just ski it till it just explode, you know? <laughs> just like blow up, rip the bindings out something. Just like, oh, you know, land there. Like, shit, time to go back to the drawing board. But, uh, you know, after a few years of testing, it came up with good construction, good uh, some good shapes, and yeah, brought it to market in 2006. And uh, you folks that are listening to this interview, you hear that music in the background. That uh, is the music for the night. <laughs> the ninth annual Red Rocks big party that these guys put on. What's the, the correct name? Yeah, we call it uh, Winter on the Rocks. Winter on the Rocks. Yeah, it's the first and only winter concert at Red Rocks. So yeah, that's been a fun, fun process. You know, we we partnered up with AEG to do it. And uh, you know, we had to get the city of Denver on board because they technically own the facility. And uh, we got on board and you know, this was our ninth year doing it. So every year it just continues success, sold out show. A uh, great way to like host our dealers, bring media and then also like you know open it up to the public so awesome. ten thousand strong raging <laughs> well, well we appreciate icelandic skis that's for sure <laughs> it is mutual let's go rip let's go yeah. rip